Hey everyone, Billy here with Ultra Bright Lights, and welcome back to part seven of our series, where we take a deep dive into the quad converter and its vast number of functions using a Phoenix Quad GPL full-size light bar. If you wanna see all other parts, be sure to head over to our YouTube channel and check out the Quad Converter YouTube playlist, which you can also access by clicking on the iCard in the top right-hand corner. In this video, we will be going over the flood modes. Flood mode has been broken down into four separate functions on the quad converter. Mode 19 is your front flood, which includes the two front corners. Mode 20 is your rear flood, which includes the two rear corners. Mode 21 is your passenger side or right alley flood, which is the two corners and the alley. And mode 22 is your driver side or left alley flood, which is the front and rear corner and the left alley light. Having them all on will give you a nice 360 degrees of coverage, which is a standard for a flood mode. Now, just like previous modes that we've talked about, you can deactivate modules along your flood mode. Difference between the flood mode and something like brake is that instead of the modules deactivating from in to out, the front and rear will deactivate from outside to in. So each tap of the pattern select button will decrease your two end modules until you get all the way down to just your two center takedowns. The same thing will go for your alleys. One tap of the pattern select button will deactivate both corners and just leave you with your alley floods. Flood mode is a high priority mode and will override your flashing modes. So I have a front flashing mode on, I'll activate my front flood and those two takedown modules that I configured before will stay on. Another difference between flood mode and brake mode is that with brake mode, if you remember, any modules that were deactivated for your brake mode would stay deactivated even if you ran a rear flashing mode. With flood mode, any of the modules that you deactivated will go back to running a flashing mode if you're going to run flood and flash at the same time. Have any questions about flood mode or any other aspect about the Phoenix Quad? Let us know in the comments down below. Subscribe to our channel to stay up to date with all of our latest content. Stay tuned for part eight of the series where we'll be going over cruise mode. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.